crazy today let me just let me just turn the blinds down get your foot out of here okay yay that's so much better oh my god that's so much better what's good everybody hope you are doing well welcome back to the episode of alone that was a weird start but truly i do hope y'all are doing well are you doing well okay all right okay okay all right okay um, today I spent <laughs> a lot of money. <laughs> I was just throwing stuff into the basket that I truly did not need. At one point, I remember I was like looking at cat litter. I don't have a cat. I don't have a cat. <laughs> but that's just what Target does to you. I don't know if I told you that I went to Target, but hey, I went to Target and I purchased a lot of stuff. And today we're going to be doing a haul. Literally just went to get dishwasher pods. That's it. Why did I spend one hour and 59 minutes, two hours, in there buying stuff that I did not need? The last thing that I put in my freaking cart was the dishwasher pods. Oh, get over here. We have a lot of stuff to get into. Like, there's a lot of stuff over here. Get into it. First thing I got was this. Uh oh. Um, yeah. What is this called? A shower curtain. I honestly wanted just like a straight up gray, no patterns, no anything, no embellishment. You can sort of see it has this sort of pattern on there. When you see it at large and you step back, it's just gonna look like pretty modern and that's kind of what I want, you know? I was like, I might as well get it. It was $20. I actually got two of them, one for this bathroom and one for the other bathroom. I'm actually really excited about this because I've been showering with no shower curtain and I ain't trying to turn my bathroom into a swimming pool. So let's move on to the next thing. I also got these hooks also for the bathroom. I literally sat there in the aisle with all the hooks and like looked at all of them like 17 times. It's the same hook 12 different times in different packages. So I was like, the limit does not exist. The limit does not exist. Trying to figure it out because like, what's the difference between all them dang hooks? What's not clicking? Anyway, I just snatched these ones. I actually got this for the bathroom because I wanted to put my towel on it. And when you all see my bathroom, you'll see that there's no like hooks or rods or anything right near my shower. Oh. Why does this hey. memory, tell me why this memory card says four minutes. It says I got four minutes of footage left. Oh, this motherfucker playing with me. Let me go. <sighs> okay, we're back. I deleted all of the other footage. So yeah, yeah get into it, it. I bought this. What the freak is that? This is a cutting board because y'all haters is chopped. No, but seriously, I needed a cutting board and this one is a beautiful dark wood. Obviously got it at Target, made by Design, which is the Target brand. It's made of acacia wood, it's non-slip. It has these little things on the bottom. Okay, so it's a serving board, but it's also a cutting board. So that's great. Don't be shy, eat some more. That's gonna be me at my parties when I'm hosting my parties. Next up we have, let's see, bar mop dish towels. What does that mean? Bar mop? There's four of them, they were a dollar each. It was literally $3.99. They're this dark gray color, which I'm obsessed with. I love this. I love these like dark grays and blacks and deep wood colors like this. Why, why? Tell me why I put this in my car, car. What is this? A protein perfection birthday cupcake flavored protein bar. Repackage? Hold up. Oh. What does that mean? It was on clearance. And I just now read that it said repackage. What does re, also my nails, Jesus Christ. What does a repackage mean? I don't know if I wanna eat this. I got two of them. I got one in birthday cake and another one in um, salted caramel chocolate. So, I mean, this will be good for like a snack, even though I am the snack. I got this, um, I got these plates. Does it look like I need more plates? Yes. No. Yeah, yeah, you do. What, really? Wait, what does that even mean? I don't know, I just said it. Oh, okay. I got these black, like, plastic, but like, dishwasher safe plates. I just figured, I don't know if I have guests over. What guest will? What guest? Who's coming over? <laughs> no, but if I do have guests over, I guess that they'll use these. These were only 79 cents, which is a great alternative to paper plates and like all that stuff. Don't pollute, look at all the pollution. And they're really cute. They're like a cute little minimal design. Speaking of minimal design, how are you guys liking my bedroom? There's nothing in it. <laughs> Next up, we got this um, little dish rack from Threshold. 
I didn't necessarily need this, you know what I mean? But I definitely wanted it because whenever I am not uh, like using my dishwasher, I'm gonna, just gonna wash my dishes by hand. Like it's not a big deal. And I sort of needed something to put those dishes in while they dry. And so this is great. I actually sort of like downgraded in size. I had one before that was stainless steel, also from Threshold but it was like two times as big. But um, I don't foresee myself like putting too many dishes in the dish rack anymore because I got a dishwasher, so there's that. Oh yeah, I forgot I bought this. Oil and vinegar dispensers. These are great to keep the oils and the vinegars fresh and to have them quick and easy right there so I can just grab them. They're eight and a half ounces. I was gonna buy some. These were actually made in Italy. Wow, that's cool. I actually had some of these bottles in my cart on Amazon because I just like throw stuff in my Amazon cart even though I ain't gonna buy it. But sometimes I do buy it and that's when I cry at night. <laughs> oh, you want some vinegar on that salad? There you go. You want some oil on that salad? There you go. You want another salad? I don't got that for you. You gotta get out. You eating all my food. You eat everything. Next, we have some more of these babies. I meal prep every Sunday. I um, will just go ahead and make all my food. Rice, broccoli, carrots, sweet potatoes, onions, squash, stuff like that, all for like a veggie side. And then um, maybe like chicken breast. <laughs> I just season the chicken. These are really, really great because it's just so simple. When I'm hungry, instead of like compiling stuff on a plate, pop one of these bad boys out and just warm it up in the microwave and eat it. This, oh my God. These were $10 and it comes with 10? Yeah, it comes with 10. Wow, that's crazy. Oh my God. This is something I've been wanting for a long time. This black silverware. So modern, love it. I was gonna get some off of Amazon, but I found them in um, Target for cheaper. On Amazon, it would have been like $24.99. I just found these for like $19.99, so that's great. Found these. Hold up. Wait. Oh my God, are you kidding me? I thought there was more in here. There's just one of each. Oh no. Congratulations, you played yourself. This joint says service for one. Oh no girl, we returning you. You going in the return pile. That's a new pile that I'm starting right now. Oh, over here I have this bath mat. Okay. Oh! She's wide. She's also comfy, there's memory foam in here. This was expensive. This joint was $22. Why was it $22? I don't understand. I, I swear to God, I don't understand. I swear to God, I don't understand. I got out of the shower the other day, um, and you would've thought I was at the summertime slip and slide, and I rebuked that in the name of Six Flags Water Park. <laughs> so, this is the thing that I came to freaking Target for. These freaking finished pods. Apparently, this, these will last me um, a whole year, apparently. I've never had a dishwasher. Like, I never had that. Forgot that this apartment had one. So when I walked in and I saw that dishwasher, girl, it was just me and that dishwasher. Me, we just, we just, I just looked at it, it looked at me, and we just had a moment, we connected. But um, I realized that you need to buy stuff for it, like specifically. I'm broke. I don't even know what the price was, and I'm kind of scared to look at the receipt. The smaller version of this that had, I think, 40 pods was like $15. God knows how much this one cost. It better not have been $30, y'all. I'm returning it, and I'm returning that dishwasher. Um, Next up, I also got this Listerine Total Care. I was gonna get the one that was alcohol free, but then, like, I wanted to kill the germs. You know what I mean? I wanted to kill the bad breath germs. Your breath stinks so bad. <laughs> I like this one way better than the the, the yellowish one. Ew, wait, I just thought of the color of that. That color is not cute. I don't like that color and I rebuke it in the name of the color wheel. This is the stuff that you cannot, like, leave around kids because they'll think it's juice. It's not the grape drink, man. Next, I got this, which is sort of like a shoe drop off, like a boot, well, what do they call it? A boot tray. <laughs> it's a boot tray. Would you like a boot, man? Okay, one boot for you. It's a boot tray, you sit it down uh, right by the door, clean it when you need to, it's really easy to clean. This is great, this is something that I knew I wanted when I moved here, I was like, okay. The floors are all this like laminate, brown, dark brown tile, and when the sun shines onto the floor, you can see any dirt, girl. And luckily, like, my apartment has really great filtration. And there's not much dust, but you can see dirt. And so whenever I, like, I don't know, when I wear my shoes too far into the house, you can see that I was, like, stepping in there. So I got these to put my shoes down. And for anyone, any of my imaginary friends, fake guests that I think that I'm going to have in the future can put their shoes and their fake shoes here. So, oh, I got cups as well to match those plates. I like to use glassware. So these gonna be for the guests. 
and that's on period. <laughs> Spray paint, oh my God. And girl, they really asked my ID to buy this. They were like, oh, we need to see your ID. What y'all think I'm gonna do with that spray paint? Eat it. I'm gonna do some DIYs with this. This orange, I think I'm gonna paint a picture frame orange or something. Maybe I'm gonna, oh, I think I'm gonna use it on my clock. I have a clock that I got from Savers that I wanna redo. And then I also got this black one, it's in semi-gloss. And I just wanna spray all of my picture frames with this. This is the second shower curtain I got. I'm really glad I got these. These are really cute actually. And they're like really heavy and good, good quality. Really heavy and good quality, me. Heaven, heaven. Okay, next up I got this toaster. Tostadora de pan para cuatro rebanadas con las ranuras. Ranuras? What is ranuna? Ranuras. Con las ranuras bien anchas. Girl, I don't know what that means. This is great. I always wanted a four slot toaster because sometimes, mind your own business, I like to eat two bagels. Okay, this is like a boring purchase, but very necessary if you ever had your own apartment, your own house, your own oven. Um, you kind of want one of these little things. It's a non-stick sort of pad that goes beneath your oven because sometimes stuff falls down there. If you leave it in there, it'll just burn and encrust and turn into just like a, a carbon stain and you're just like, ew, that's nasty. And it's hard to clean your stove after that. All my appliances in my apartment are brand new because this apartment was just built. So I do want to keep all of the appliances like as new as possible. Ooh, these are my favorite purchases. I love these little things. Listen, these are a dollar at Target. These are literally the cheapest items you can find at Target. Anybody want some soup? Would anyone like some stew? And then we also have this just to like stir a pot. You know, we love stirring the pot. These were a dollar and they're so cute and they're so minimalist. Dinner, dinner is served. Dinner is served. It's a, it's a, pro, it's a protein bar. You don't like protein bars? Repackage, hold up. Next, I have hand towels for my bathrooms. I got two of them. They were like pretty cheap. I don't know, I really enjoyed this color. I want some like really nice like Gucci <laughs> or like Dior hand towels. Like really nice soft plush hand towels that are gonna last forever. Like that's what I mean by that. I don't, they don't necessarily need to be Gucci, but it would be nice. <laughs> Zaddy, <laughs> when you try to get your sugar daddy to get you something. I don't really need Gucci, but it would be nice. <laughs> I just realized I'm broke. Ooh, okay, so next, oof, I got a knife set. What is that? I know. Very dark gray situation. And I told y'all, like literally, people always go, oh my God, I chose a theme for my apartment. Like the theme, they always say theme but you mean color scheme. That's what you really mean. <laughs> That's just a pet peeve of mine. People are always like, hmm, I need to choose a theme for my apartment. Hmm, maybe red, white, and blue. It's like, no, that's a color scheme. A theme would be traditional, contemporary, modern, country, or whatever Dolly Parton's house might look like. But for me, like I chose a color scheme of just like dark, muted, grays. <laughs> that's pretty much it. If you're an adult, or if you cook like an adult, <laughs> Um, although adults out here really don't know how to cook. I don't know how to cook. I kind of know how to cook. You know that knives are a pretty big deal and good ones are good ones. I remember cutting something once and I was like, Oh my God, because you're from, oh my God. This knife sucks. And I went out and I bought a new knife and I came back and I was like, this knife bucks. As in, this go up. As in, Stop! I got this trash can from my bathroom. I hope it wasn't, yo, I swear, I swear if this was $10, I'm taking it back. It's just a simple basket and I think it looks really modern and you know, as long as you keep it clean, it'll look good and not like cheap, you know? I also got this um, like drawer liner. This is great for grip and all that stuff. Make sure that, wait, why, why do people buy this? Okay, let's move on. Now that's it from Target, yay, stop. I have a few things from Amazon that were delivered today, so I'm just gonna open that. Also, let me know down below, y'all, if y'all like these kind of videos, cause like I, these are easy for me to make. Like I just open up stuff and talk about it. That's so much fun to me. Um, but if y'all don't like these videos and y'all truly hate them and you want them to, I don't know, burn, then that's fine. Just tell me. Ooh, these are cute. These are small. What the hey? I thought they were so much bigger than what they were. But I mean, I guess it's kind of cute though. So I got these like cute little trays, stone, and it has a nice felt background, background, <laughs> felt bottom um, on the bottom. So kind of like, it's, it's really soft. They come in this geometric sort of situation. So I don't know if I want to put this in my bathroom or where I want to put this, I don't know, but this is cute. It was kind of expensive, but I also saw today in Target a little soap tray that was like $14.99 and it was like so tiny. 
$14.99? Y'all joint better come with the soap. Okay, what is this? Oh, I know what this is. I'll be paying extra for things to come assembled because I'm my fingers are raw, ma'am. I've been putting things together for the last like six days. Wow, these are cute though. Okay, so I got these candle holders. Like these candlestick holders. And they're super minimalist. And it's just a cute candle holder. These are gonna be super cute. Wow. Amazing. Next. Oh my god, they're super cute. I kind of want to put this on my coffee table, maybe. Oh, maybe I could put a candle on top of that thing. Oh my God, cute. Oh my God, this has felt on it too. I love when things come with felt bottoms that, so that they don't ruin your wooden tables. Wow, look at how cute these are. Cute little geometric pieces. Okay, that's pretty much it, y'all. I have a lot of stuff to put away now. And so y'all gotta go. <laughs> you gotta get out. As you can see, I am in my new apartment. I'm excited. I did go ahead and sort of like make over the living room already. Um, it's not completely finished. I have to put some artwork up, but it's looking pretty good if I do say so myself. It's looking pretty good. I'm not trying to brag, but I gotta, you know, dust my own shoulder off. But anyway, that brings us to the end of this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and give it a big old thumbs up. And if you want to stick around, be my friend, be my homie, and continue um, on this journey of decorating my apartment. I'm going to give uh, like the behind the scenes situation on this channel. Any DIYs that I have to do etc um i'm gonna put up on this channel if you want to stick around and be my friend be my homie and stick around for that go ahead and click the subscribe button don't forget to follow me on facebook twitter instagram snapchat and my second not my second but my main youtube channel will on a win hope to see y'all babies back here real soon why is my elbow like that that's awkward let's do it like this no that's awkward too like that Hope to see you all back here real soon for another episode of Will on a Whim. But until then, bye.